This video clip presents the conceptual design stage related improvements of ARCHICAD 17. The improved scheduling features of Morph Elements greatly helps architects create mass models at the conceptual design phase. You can see three building masses on the floor plan created with the Morph tool. Let's open a section view. As you can see, the blue morph shape represents a multi-story tower. Let's open the 3D window to display all the building masses in 3D. Let's activate the predefined conceptual design schedule from the project map of the navigator. This can be found under the schedules element container. This schedule displays area as well as the volume for each story of the conceptual design elements, even if one single morph's body was used to create each building mass. This schedule also lists the total area and total volume for every building mass. At the bottom of the list, you can also see the total area and volume values for all three buildings. Let's open the Scheme Settings dialog to see how to create such lists. Let's display the criteria page of the dialog and select the morph element type and also the layer where the morph elements were created. Let's switch to the fields tab page and check out the general parameter list. Please note that the ID and the home story parameters have already been added to the schedule fields on the right. Below these, we can also see two morph element related parameters. These are the area by story and the volume by story parameters. These can be added to the schedule fields by selecting the appropriate morph parameters from the list on the left. Please note the flag icon next to the ID parameter on the right side. By activating this flag, we can display the sum of the various element types separately. The Sum button after the area and volume parameters is also displayed, so the sum of both entries will be provided for the individual elements. Let's display the 3D view of the project again. We'll modify the height of the red building mass using the Smart Cursor in the tracker. Let's return to the schedule. And please notice that four new stories have been automatically added to the schedule of the red building. The automatically created and updated morph schedule lists display story-specific values even at the conceptual design phase. This provides great help and input for designers to make sure that the building is created according to the program. 